Hi guys, so I wanted to do a uh, all top fall and winter trends uh, for this year, and I thought it'd be a fun video. It was actually requested. Oh, and by the way, I did get a haircut. Um, if you can't tell, it's really, really layered. So I'm going to show you four trends, and let's get started. Okay. Okay, this first trend is lace, and if you can't see, I am, well, if this is a lace shirt, I'll get closer. That's lace. Okay. Lace is so huge. I don't know how it just kind of sparked up. And it's like these lace shirts are just the cutest thing. Like mine ha is from Free People. And I, ha I paired it with um, this like Free People um, pink tank top. And it's just so cute. It's so pretty. And I mean this will get you a lot of compliments. I mean like even like a shirt just like tight like this I guess. That's really cute. And I'll show you what I paired with this outfit. With this outfit, I paired with a Free People bracelet. You should also, he's like seen this all in my Free People haul, but uh, I paired it with this bracelet, just really cute. And then I have my owl necklace from Forever 21. And I I paired it with these purple cords uh, from Madewell, which I got last year. But, you know, corduroys really are kind of always in. Corduroys are always great and really great for winter because they're warm and comfortable. And I paired it with these shoes. These are my Steve Madden shoes. They are, they're ballet flats as you can see and they just kind of have like sparkly stuff on them. And they just go really great with the purple and the corduroys. So that is trend number one, lace. Okay, so the next trend is grunge. Now this here I have, it's a navy blue um, kind of sweater thing from Free People. I got it last year, but again, this grunge is so amazingly big this year. And what I did was I paired it with a, uh, just like this cute, a simple necklace. When I wear grunge, I don't want to go all out with jewelry because I like to be comfortable in grunge. And I also have this cute little necklace from J. Crew, and it kind of matches. I mean, not necklace. When I say necklace, I mean headband. And my balloon is here. It was, like, for my, my 15th birthday in, like, August. And that's kind of a while ago. <laughs> but it's still flying, so it's still kind of in my room. Anyway, and then I paired this with a, just kind of this, like, pencil skirt kind of thing from Topshop. And I like, when I wear grunge, too, I also, my balloon's coming back. I'm like, I'm, like, trying to, like... Hit it. And, okay, it's going away now. Um, okay. Okay, so I paired it with this pencil skirt kind of thing from Topshop. It's tan. It's really, I like this really fun, like, design on it. I don't know, you can't really see, but, um, and I paired it with these, like, tights also from Topshop. There's just, like, this, like, fun tights, and I wore this outfit, except for, like, different kind of tights this school, and I got a lot of compliments on it, so this is just kind of a fun outfit to wear. I mean, grunge is very good with tight things uh so skinny jeans and you know skirts like this great with grunge because it kind of contrasts and it also makes the grunge look way more comfortable and that's kind of what you're going for you're going for this comfortable high fashion look and yeah if you're looking for grunge definitely go check out free people because they have the greatest grunge variety of like all the people i've seen because they've like been the grunge <laughs> they're like the grunge store they have all this grunge stuff and i love it i love it i love it Anyway, I like the big grunge because it's not, because uh, I don't wear sweatshirts to school, so I want to have something comfortable that looks very high fashion. So, yeah. Then what I would pair with it for shoes is I would either pair it with, like, Doc Martin combat boots, which I showed you in my last video. Uh, like, something like this because they're just fun. I preferably would go with more black boots if you're having, like, a colorful outfit like this, more black. Or I would pair them with my Madewell boots, and these are my favorite boots of all time. So they're super comfortable and there's just like this and these are kind of if you haven't if you don't have brown boots like this just like simple boots go out and get boots like this because these are also very in right now okay so the next trend is sparkle sparkly anything i love sequins so this was not a tr this is a trend that i had going on really before you know the trend really hit magazines the reason why i really liked sparkle was because i was kind of walking um me, me and my dad were going christmas shopping last year and so we were walking down and then i saw this jacket in the window it's from madewell and i saw it in the window and i started hopping up and down like crazy and I was like I need this jacket this jacket was amazing because it reminded me totally of Serena Vanderwoodson and you know when Serena Vanderwoodson is wearing something in Gossip Girl you know 
it's in fashion or it is about to become a big part of the fashion world. So, of course, I had to get it. And, you know, now with Sparkle has, or Sparkly Things have gone really, really big. So, that's really good. And, you know, I really want to get, like, a black one of these, too, because black's a cool color. Um, so, this is what I paired it with. I paired it with this, like, cute, like, tan tank top. It actually has, like, stuff on the side, uh, which is cute. And I have it paired with this J. Crew necklace. It's, like, this orange necklace, and it has, like, stuff on the side, and it's just kind of gold. And in this, I also paired it with one of these, a bracelet my friend made for, with, a friend made for me. It's really cute. I absolutely love this. Um, she, like, took, like, magazine and, like, wrapped it around and created it, and I thought this was just so cute. And, you know, it's dirty. It's minimalist, so, and you want to stick to minimalist stuff when you're wearing the sequins. Uh, cause, you know, you don't want to have, like, a really flashy shirt and sequins. You just want to have, like, the, um, either a flashy shirt and simple jacket or a flashy jacket, simple shirt. So, you want to go very minimalist. And then, these are these gray skinny jeans from Ralph Lauren Rugby. And I love them because of the pockets. Aren't these, like, the cutest pockets? They're just so cute. And then, they also have, like, I can't, I'm trying to show you. It's, like, um, this, like, zipper thing right here. I don't know. Um, but what I would definitely wear this with is also my boots because these are minimalist and again, minimalist is good. Or you can pair them with booties. I actually, my only booties I have right now are suede black booties and I need to get like leather, um, brown booties because black suede booties do not go well with this. So I've got to get onto that. There's some I like from Zappos that are really cute. So I gotta get on to that and get those soon. So yeah. So that is the sparkle trend. Yeah. Okay, so the last trend is Admiral Jackets. This has been big since last year. And of course, it's still very in this year. And who doesn't love these cute Admiral Jackets? This is from Free People. Um, like all the clothes I've shown you today have been like my haul from Free People. But you know what? Still. <laughs> um, and I just had these cute buttons and these cute sleeves and cute, cute, cute back. And I paired it with this blue tank top from Forever 21 and these jeggings, which I got from Madewell. Now, jeggings are still in, and if you don't have a pair of jeggings, go get some. Jeggings are really fun because if you don't have your jeans handy or you just want to be more comfortable than just wearing jeans, you can throw on some jeggings. And... Yeah, and if you don't know what jeggings are, they are basically denim leggings. Um, and so yeah, so yeah, I got these at Madewell. And another thing you could wear with the Admiral jacket for pants would be jodhpurs, because the jodhpur style is so in right now, very in. And I'm also pairing it with this cute scarf from Layla Rose. It's a store in New York. Um, they're kind of all over the city, and they have these really, like, cute, like, accessories. It's kind of, like, accessorized in England with less clothes. So, I really think it's cute. And if you don't want to go with the scarf, you could go with the sparkly necklace. And I got this from Madewell, too. And, no, I'm not sponsored by Madewell Free People or, or like, Topshop or any of the brand I'm showing you. I just really like these stores. So. <laughs> and my booties are suede booties. I was just talking about them. They're from Boutique 9. They look like this when I get closer. They have, like, interesting detail. And they're really cute. They have a really small heel, but they're really good for school because they're not, like, the heel's not big, so you're not, like, it's not hard to walk, so they're good. And then they just match the outfit very well, so, yeah. Okay, so those are the top four trends that I wanted to talk about today because I thought these are really fun and cute and very easy to find. They're very accessible. Um, and you can find them for really cheap prices in like Forever 21 um, and you know, or like Charlotte Russe. Oop, I just kicked my closet. Um, you know, those kind of stores. So definitely go out, find these trends, buy them, and they will last you probably into next year, I'm thinking, because they're just, they're very, very stylish right now and I can't imagine they go to style like that. Because they're just so cute. Okay. Well, that's enough of me babbling about the trends. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Comment, rate, subscribe. I will see you guys later. Bye.